please? Are you in there? Come out and play. <gasps> Come on, we know you're there. Can't hide from us. Zoe, come out here. Right now. Don't make us resort to drastic, drastic measures. Kent, you ignorant slut. Man of Steel is the greatest Superman film ever made. Man of Steel is an atrocity, and the greatest doesn't really mean a lot. We're talking about a film franchise where the greatest threat to Superman was Richard Pryor. Uh, until Man of Steel. That movie had everything. One, it was dark. Two, it was dark. Three, it had murder by the millions and destruction, and it was, four, it was grittier than Ben Grimm's urine. What do you want? Okay, first of all, ugh. Second of all, Superman should not be gritty. Do you hear me, everyone? Superman should not be gritty. Hey, Zobo, you're gross. What do you think about gritty Superman? Cool or uncool? So, not in the mood, Derpico. Who pissed in her box of pockies? <gasps> what? Somebody pee peed on her Japanese snack sticks. I. Summers. Huh? Uh, I was saying, I think you'll be a great fit here at some brands, and you'll see that it's something special to be at this place. I, uh, I, I think despite the fact that you uh, don't have any experience, your scholastic achievements look impressive enough, and considering your rather unorthodox appearance for a job interview, we'd love to have you. Are you serious? Unorthodox? Well, you dress like a witch. And it's July. I'm Kiki, from Kiki's Delivery Service. I thought it was obvious. Delivery service? I didn't think you had a job. I don't. That's why you're interviewing me, right? Look, we both know I'm only here because my dad wants to keep his company in the family or whatever, but it's just not for me. Okay, well, your dad wants me to give you a job. What am I supposed to tell him? Tell him that I'm going to win first place at the Metro City Comic Con cosplay contest. <laughs> And that I'll, you know, find a job on my own terms. Uh, find a job on your own terms? Miss Summers, wait. This is a great company. I, I don't think you... We'll give you a mug. Look, opportunities like this don't knock on your door every day. So, are you okay? I'm fine. I'm always fine. Bet you wouldn't talk to Inuyasha that way. Make like the city of Kandor and bottle it. Zoe, wait up! Hey, are you okay? Because I haven't seen you this upset since Jake threw all the Lady Thor comics away and screamed, it's got dongs or it's all wrong! I just got chased by a feral badger. It's been a problem in our building for months. Badger? That's odd. Badgers tend to live far from human habitats. Wait, are you sure? Do you know what species it was? Can you describe this badger? What? No! What are you, like a badger expert? Well, I don't mean to brag, but I am the latest editor of the North American Badger Wikipedia page. Your family must be very proud. My family's deceased. Well, they die of boredom. Would everyone just shut up about badgers and family members? Sorry. It's just, um... Way for 
for perfection. Ooh, is that my reflection? To protect our family's wealth and power. To make our business rivals cower. We're rich and we're pretty. The hottest twins in Metro City. Sarah. Simon. Twin Summers. Um, welcome to the destination. How may I help you? We're here to talk to our dear baby sister. Sister? Wait a minute, so you're all, you're all, um... Related? Hard to believe, I know. We got all the looks. Not to mention the class. Hmm. Hmm. Um... Don't you get it? We're twins. And Gogglehead over there is our eccentric little sister. Yeah, not by choice. So, is your family from Westeros, or...? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, Simon. This explains so much about Zoe. Anyways, we need to have a serious chat. We're here to bring our baby sister home. Oh, wow, home. Okay, uh, that's interesting. Say, guys, could we take this somewhere a little more private? Oh, goodness. Ah, my suit! Oh. No, seriously, the best Superman is when he had a mullet, though. Quest for peace! Oh, oh good. Oh, gosh, Zoe! So what oh, oh, oh. the hell, guys? You want to bring me home? I have a home and a life, so thank you, but no. Oh, honey, sweetie, you live in a shoebox. That father pays for. And you spend your life hanging out at uh, tchotchke stores. With unshaven degenerates. I don't just hang out here. I work here. I'm also going to Metro City Community College to study art. Art major? Community college? Oh, I think I'm going to throw up. Why? Oh, really, it's you and your... Art? Yes, art. Is this about those weird costumes you like to make? Or did something happen to you on Halloween to make you this way? I mean, have you already forgotten about the humiliating failure you suffered in pursuit of this dream of yours? Let's hear it one more time for yet another Ghostbuster, Bentley, everyone! Bentley! <laughs> Up next, we have Zoe Summers making her Metro City Comic Con cosplay debut as the beloved witch Kiki from Kiki's Delivery Service. Woo! Oh, uh, Kiki, are you back there? Come on, don't be shy. Come on, everybody, let's help bring Kiki out. Come on, Kiki, show us your stuff! Kiki, where are you? Come in, that's me. Excuse me, excuse me, sorry, excuse me. Kiki's here to deliver the goods! Is my bow crooked? What are you doing? Sweet Studio Ghibli! This is a family event! <gasps> I mean, really? A sexy kinky cosplay? No, 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 no! Ah! It's hussies like you that give cosplaying a bad reputation! Miyazaki would be appalled! No, no, this is not so good! You tried that costume thing and you failed. And now we're here, at Father's behalf, to give you some direction again. He's offered to give you another chance at some brands. It'll be an intern position, of course. But maybe eventually he'll promote you up to a position more befitting his daughter. Please. You can't make it on your own. You need us. You, you need, need your, your family. family. Hmm. Hmm. Brother. Hmm. 
Stop it! Just stop that. That is messed up. This whole family is messed up. I have no intentions of coming to work for father. Fine. Let's see how far you get when daddy cuts you off. What? Your credit cards, bi-weekly deposits, and trust fund will be going. Bye-bye. He's been saying that since I moved out. He wouldn't. He already has. In fact, he shut off your phone. Service terminated. Son of a! And if you don't quit this social experiment you call a job... And come home to a career more suited to the education he paid for... Then he's going to be shutting down everything else. He said you have one month to decide. Here's a prepaid burner phone. There's only one number in there, and it's father's. Call him when you've made your decision. I do hope you'd come to your senses and decide correctly. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. oh, take care. Toodaloo. You're telling me that you're really excited to see a grim, moody Justice League movie where they're all moping around true detective style and murdering every villain they encounter? You really want to see Aquaman deadpan, no horseplay in the pool, and then put a bullet in Black Manta's head? That's what you want to see? Yeah, no one wearing underwear on the outside of their pants? I'm an adult. That's what I want. What's wrong with that? Everything! Superman is a hero because at the end of the day, when presented with a difficult choice, he sticks to his principles. He doesn't take the easy way out. He does the right thing. Yeah. It's the studios and the corporate suits who want him to change. Bingo. But Superman is one of a kind. He's fine on his own. Yeah, he doesn't need Zack Snyder. Right? right? Yeah. I mean, why should he have to leave his home and his friends to go work some nine to five for his estranged father? I mean, they haven't even spoken in years. And then you're going to be all like, hey, send your siblings in. I'm going to go get you to do the job thing. And I'm going to... Superman shouldn't be gritty. Zoe, I want you to listen very closely to what I'm about to say. Is this the badger that you saw? Or is, is it close? Like on a scale of one to four, how similar is this badger to the one that you saw? That's it, Adam. That's it. You're all dumb. I'm leaving. Jake out. Um, what was that all about? I was just agreeing The Superman, you know, shouldn't be gritty. No, yeah. no, I mean you and your creepy sex twins. I didn't even know you had sex twins. You never talk about your family. There's nothing to talk about. Sweet Christmas. They should give those two their own reality show and then immediately cancel that reality show. Yeah. The real sex twins in Metro City. <laughs> <laughs> Gross. Well, anyway, I, I'm glad you're the one who wound up working in my store. If you ever need to talk about anything, let me know. Thanks. It's good to know that. Actually, I could really use someone to talk about. Oh, my God! Hold that thought. I just had, like, the worst day ever. Here. It was, why are you putting your clothes it's, on me? It's comforting. It's fine. Tell me okay, about you. What happened? I just, what happened? Uh, I found out the hard way that you can't get a fresh spray tan wet. Oh. I'm splotchy all over in places.
I wanted to see how much I could get for these. <laughs> yeah. Pizza high five! Oh! <laughs> Dadtastic. Right up. Oh, I'm, I'm so sorry. Jake, a customer awaits. Catch you on the flip side, Oh, buddy. cool, man. Yeah, later. Oh, and Ken, I hope nothing ever comes between us. Ah! You're my best friend. What can I do for you? Yeah, I wanted to see how much I could get for these. Oh, let's see what you got here. Oh, Berserk! You know, I just started this series. I've been trying to bone up on my manga. Uh, yeah, that's my favorite. Awesome. The shipment for New Comic Book Day is here. Woohoo! New Comic Book Day! My favorite! Oh, and uh, Josie's on the phone for you. Great! Tell my little Joe cast I'll be right there. Oh, and boss, I like your mustache. Aw, thanks, buddy. I like your mustache, too. Uh, listen, if I were you, I'd just go ahead and hold on to this. I'm not gonna be able to pay you Babu and Squat for him anyway. Oh. But, um, you know, you seem to know a lot about manga. My assistant manager doesn't know anything about, well, anything really, except badgers. And manga's currently my nerd blind spot. I, I could use someone like you if you're looking for a job. Really? Uh, okay, uh, cool, that would be great. Great. Well, come by tomorrow, we'll set up an interview. I think you'll be a great fit at the destination. 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 Why do you keep Des saying that? What? I, I, just, just practicing? Uh, so you had a bad day? Well, yeah, and then I thought that Dick Van Dyke was dead. Oh. And he's like my retro crush. Right. Like, I just loved him. Yeah, it should be sweet. Chitty Bang Bang. So